Alright, Kitson. If that is your real name, and I'm not confusing you with a pal from Pal World. Huh, nice. You went down really quickly. Thanks for messing around and some more Vampire Survivors. Beswick, episode 218. We'll see how well CO2 Moonspell does. And it's only duplicator only Ebos. Inlay library, let's go. Not CO2. Not Moon Menu version. Regular version. It's really slow. These are not things I want. That barely is, but it's duplicator only, so. And there's my lightning ring. Empty tome, because of course. Get that revive going. Triple evolution. Triple evolution. Does anything else come close to that? Not having that area is going to be killer, but... Alright, cooldown already up. Oh, let's get the projectiles going. Oh, Melison. Well, that's projectiles for everything. Obviously you want that. I'm going to go after the Atlanteans for eventually. It's going to be a bit to get there. Oh, homing miss. <laughs> I mean, heck, it's basically firing out continuously as it is. The damage on that. 30, 40? Not actually terrible considering the speed at which it fires. A lot of weapons would kill for that. So they could kill. Ha <laughs> ha oh, I'm actually getting this done earlier. I can actually count it on two hands before it has to go up. Perhaps the next one with Babiona will be even better. I might actually need someone else's hands and feet to count it. Could you imagine a backlog? I might actually be able to push back against missing three days. In fact, I really should do that. Tomorrow is also the day where I have to give up two hours of my time. The backlog just might put me back on schedule. <laughs> and inevitably, my alarm will go off and I will just ignore it. Oh, mummy. You know, I really just associate you more with Mad Force because of how that rolls. Hey, now I can see if I can get another projectile. Oh, hey. Man, this Melisse is lasting for a very long time. It's pretty incredible. Like, what even are regular enemies? This has got to be like three minutes at least, right? For the longest still Melisse of all time. Am I just getting them back to back like this? That's crazy. Oh, there's another mummy. They're really back to back mummies. Oh, thunder ring. Or lightning ring. Goes into thunder loop. It's not actually lightning, it's thunder. Anyway, ride product of lightning, but. One more projectile. Did I already max out. No, I didn't max out summon night. It just hasn't shown up in forever. Well, five damage is not exactly stellar for what I want. Mino Rush, Mino Rush, Mino Rush. 
Mm. Pierce is better than not Pierce. This is really weird. I, I have to have glitched something in. There has to have been some sort of bug. Because I just saw that Mino rush. And that was not another flower wall. Yeah, I'm gonna have to time this. See how long this has lasted. This is absurd. But nice to catch it on camera. Well, I hope I keep it on camera. But, well, kind of doubt anything's gonna kill me if I only got Melissa's coming in. One more projectile. Oh, I mean, Hawker shows up. I'm doomed, but it doesn't... Oh, hey, regular enemies. Oh, it's been so long. Hi, guys. I'm way behind the power curve. Yeah, that was like a seven-minute Melise. That was insane. Yay. More summon night. Oh, that's not good. I shouldn't be fighting you. I don't have the movement speed to deal with that. I have negative movement speed. Oh, well, there's the Mino Rush. Like, four minutes after it fired. Awkward. Huh, where did that 110 come from? Right, there's my evolution chest. I mean, there, multi stage missile. Oh, yeah, that's doing the work. Much, much better. Oh, ran into both of them. Groupie. Oh, there's a chest. We'll evolve over leveling. And the loop. And since Torona's is just there for stat boosting. I was considering both Candle Arbor and Spinach for my third, since I didn't really need one for an evolution. Oh, Arcana chest. But this gave me the most stats overall, and it did affect weapons. Oh. Oh, good. Duh. Do I get bonus health from that? I do, huh. You know... Speed boosts up multi-stage missiles, makes them a lot better. Duration affects Summon Knight and Neko Knight, so that's helpful. And everything gets boosted by area. I don't want to get more ridiculous. And of course, Might is Might. The second best stat. Obviously duration. Well, not like I'm fast, but I can still at least outrun death now. And, er, outrun the stalker now. Death? No one outruns death. They, they don't need area. It hits the full screen as it is. Jeez. I just want to get something better. Yeah, that's uh, crazy. I don't need treasure chests for anything. All my stuff's evolved. And we'll get awake just on the off chance. Well, not even the off chance. The 100% guarantee that stalker shows up and kills me. I don't really need a third. Yeah, of course, speed. 
Can't put the controller down either, just both because of the stalker and because I know the hag is durable enough to get in anyway. He's a durable lady. 50k to bit over 15, but the police really slowed down my kills. Yeah, like this. 20 minutes and already 3k, or 20 seconds in it, 3k. Should break the 100k mark pretty dang easy. That's in lay live for you, for you, other than like the final wave, kind of this dual hand wave, or headless wave, whatever it's officially called. Not much difficulty here. At the start, you can just grab garlic and run through all the dust elementals with no trouble. Yeah, I got 10k in less than a minute. If it keeps up, he gets, yeah, he gets increased curse. That's why they're coming in so thick. Yeah, if it keeps up, uh, I mean, 200k is off the table, but still, be a decent score. I remember when getting 100k was something you really had to take Wicked Season for. But then Defang, er, but then Charm existed. And it was alright. Actually, it cooked me quite a number of tries to get Genevieve Bigger Evil Version unlocked. Because I just couldn't get the number of kills correctly, even without hurry on. With regular, less evil Genevieve. Less giant red monster Genevieve. Alright, Atlantean! Show your gall, Volcano Atlantean! Ooh, that multi stage missiles. Am I gonna have to move? No, I didn't. But I did anyway because I was a scaredy cat. Scaredy wolf. Will you stop before I have to move? Yeah, this time I was totally brave and not just knowing that I would totally survive because I had already done it. True bravery is taking 100% correct action. I could have worded that better. True bravery is undertaking 100% guaranteed success actions. That's how we do it. All right, 100K, no issue. Now, let's see. Slowing down a bit. Yeah, I actually have to keep moving just so I can get more kills, huh? Alright. Take about six minutes for 60k. 150,000, not out of bounds. If I get a vacuum, that'll proc enough levels for things to go crazy. Oh, Arcana chest. You really don't want to get awake, but what else would I get? I mean, Boogaloo isn't going to help that much. Not at this level. Uh, I guess Mad Groove could work. That way I get all my XP gems. I won't rely on a vacuum. Where is it? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. He's shaking, barely hit anything. Did they get improved? It didn't feel like they were this effective last time, the multi stage missiles. They, there's bound to have been a patch at some point, even if it was just a small balancing patch. As, you know, Galaga yeah, did not feel as dangerous as it was. Well, granted, I haven't been on Inverse, so that was really the killer there. But, I don't know. 
I mean, I haven't died. I got two revives in the tank, only five minutes to go. And it's only normal. This is... Nothing's getting close. It's barely getting into the Echo Knight. Well, yeah, I'll get Mad Groove. Just so I can get all them levels. Yep, I over doubled my level on that. I almost tripled it. Like, not the greatest call, but hey. I might as well get all these. Oh, more experience, yay. Yikes, the boss Gorgon can't even get in. Wait. Why were the Gorgon... Why were the Medusa heads in the... clock tower? And not in the chapel belfry? It's where Medusa herself was. Oh, Sophia of the Night, you make no sense whatsoever. But who cares? You're one of the greatest video games of all time. And I seriously regret not putting you on the C list. Ooh, discard. Whoa. Tag? Oh no, another Atlantean out of nowhere. Curse you random events. The last mad groovin. Did the hag ever show up? You get damaged so much you died instantly. Hmm. Huh. No, I don't have increased cursed. Huh. Can I get level 200? Oh, I'm not gonna get 15. Uh, I guess they got too durable at the end. Guess maybe if I win a more killy option. Well, I broke 200. That's nice, at least. You came in fast, eh, Death? No, I can keep going. Quitting out like a quitter. Echo Knight did the most. Hey, multi stage missiles actually outdid Thunderloop. That's pretty dang impressive considering it's Thunderloop. Apparently, one of the best weapons in the base stuff. Nice, nice. In Knight Sword Waves, hello. Oh, so the Murasama didn't count. Weird. Alrighty. More Vampire Survivor's time as Yuta is heading over to the Tiny Bridge. Not much of a challenge stage for this guy. Actually, it'll be a huge one because, well, I can't really hit anything. Ooh. Maybe it'll give me closer protection, so I'll start with that. Armadillo, just so I can get empty Tome Sap. Up and pick up. It's just pure positive there. Really hard to hit things here. Oh, huh, Toronto's box. Alright, okay, get that cooldown down. Get that damage up. No trouble on inlay library, as you'd expect. Oh, right, this is gonna just run into the banister. Barrier, wall, railing, railing. This is gonna run into the railing and just... Oh, no, no, it's shooting through. Huh. Weird. There we go. 
Yeah, I was really impressed that multi-stage minstrels actually managed to outdo Thunderloop. Thunderloop's usually one of the most consistent, strong performers there is. Well, projectile in. I like the king of projectiles or anything, but hey. Three evolutions off of one passive, that's good. Now, what actually has the most evolutions? Probably one of the hearts, maybe. Well, let's think about this. Everything by default has one. Tornus of Pox has two. Ace game. This. Uh, hmm. Maybe it's Clover. No, nothing from Moonspell. I think it even got re Well, it got removed from Moonspell and Foskari. Uh, Tronus Box, no, nothing from... DLC Skull only has two. Right, Spinach. Spinach is Fire Wand and... Only Fire Wand? And anything else evolved with Spinach? Oh, that was a lot of levels. Oh, without the Melise in here. Hey, why do I have more curse? Did I really get two curse from those eggs? Crazy. Well, I can't actually risk you. If you're not an evolution chest, you're probably gonna be a silver chest and get me three, which means more curse. Yep. Okay, spinach has... Well, they removed the doubles from Moonspell and Foskari. For whatever reason. Spinach only has Fire One that I can think of off the bat. What am I even doing? I mean, I could just check this, you know. I think that shows you every bloody evolution. Yeah, spinach only has one. I'm not gonna stop the video for forever to just look at that. Uh, let's see, armor, armor has two, three, three armor. His rune tracer has, has Kizabur and the Legionnaire. And it has Sonic Bloom into Wave Cannon. Need to get you down ASAP, jeez. Give me that Arcana. Sweet, sweet Arcana that will absolutely be an evolution chest just to screw me over. Banish time. Time to banish you. Yeah, of course there's another one. Da -da -da. It's a challenge because the evolution chests come up forever later. I mean, really, that is what's most challenging about this. I guess the limited movement isn't great, but... The later evolutions against this level of enemy... Well, generally not this level of enemy, but a high level of enemy. I mean, your power isn't spiking as much as it should to keep up. No evolution, not even a gem. I need to stop moving. Oh, uh, that was way too many levels. Two, four, three. This is nine levels spent on things that are all gonna go away. And at least a constant stream of home and misses doing stuff now. Are they doing 100 damage a hit? Wow, at that fire rate, that's actually pretty good now. Oh, jeez, really? Oh. Alright, slow walk it. Let's go back and forth. I don't want to get that chicken unless it's super desperate, and they do get health. 
Once I evolve, go Menya, go Megalo, go Megalo, not go Menya. Go Menya later. Go Menya was yesterday. Okay, that's a grab chicken time. Where did it go? Why is it so far back? I did not walk this far. Ooh, or a Logan. Please be my evolution. Well, I was kind of hoping for Echo Knight to, you know, power up, but hey, this is fine. And now I don't have a choice but to grab that. Might, might, might. Area, area, area. Might. The faster the missiles go, the better. Boy, that's a good amount of area and stuff. Man, so many lightning ring amounts coming up too. Oh, you died instantly. That's nice. I'm actually going to get awake here just because, well, with the evolutions being what they are here, the Evos being what they are here. Can duplicate or only Evos do well? Yes. Yes, they can. It's baffling the world, you know. Like, I just have no idea why some videos do astronomically better than others. Or why some of them get more impressions, because... The menu video from yesterday? Huge, absolutely absurd number of impressions for some reason. I don't know why. But absolutely no views off of it. For the impression count. Way, way below my usual click rate. A fraction of it. Talking about the see who caused your video to get worse, I, I don't actually know. I mean, there are plenty of channels dedicated talking about CO and getting the YouTube up and blah blah blah. Hey, good old Echo Knight. Now I should survive. Give me that chicken. Give me that chicken. Give me that vacuum. Oh, hey, speed. Man, Echo Knight is good. Yet still, I somehow lost with this on Whiteout. With random. Go figure. No, that was supposed to be an evolution chest. Give me that evolution chest, you dang sword. I'm gonna rust you. I'm gonna rust your entire kind. Oh, do I have an FT? No. This kind of looked like it just due to the sheer volley of missiles. Yeah, I should have known because it wasn't shooting out to the end of the screen. Wow, another bat wave. Interesting. By interesting, I mean you're all dead. Suffer, suffer, die. Die, 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 die. Take that, algorithm. <laughs> Seriously baffling. It, just to put it into perspective, if I had the same click-through rate on the menu video that I did on all my others, I would have a thousand views. It would be like the most popular one on my channel. But I'll do my shorts, my Pal World shorts, which I really need to do it since I'm doing Pal World again. I'm also, well... I mean, I got the incredible flying Pyrrhon. That was nice. But what else has shown up glitchy-ish? Oh, well, I was doing stuff off camera. And I ran into a bunch of Free Pal Alliance guys just randomly shooting each other. That was funny. I wasn't recording. 
Oh, it wasn't streaming. Hey, Thunderloop. Oh man, if even these guys are going on. Heck, nah, 10k on Tiny Bridge. Not gonna happen, but hey, pretty dang close. I don't think anyone... Well, I mean, probably. It's not like I keep track of this. Or should I? What am I doing? Random always. No can't stop, because I know as soon as I do, Stalker's gonna pop up. Give me the toast. Toast? Well, I guess I'm bringing the juice, then. Man, I haven't had orange juice in years. Probably fix that. It's gotta be... Well... I mean, it's gotta be filled with sugar, and I get way too much sugar as it is. Which is impressive, because it's not like I'm slamming down the do doos Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, yeah, going through. Oh. Well, Cockatrice Wave can't do it. Nothing can. Well, I mean, I guess the final wave, but... Who, who thinks about the final wave here? I don't even know what the final wave is. Heck, I only took damage there because I was running into them because of the starburst, and I could just slowed that down. Slowed the roll. Walk forward. Destroy them all. Oh, right, it's swords at the end. Generally, you're going to have enough to take... You have enough to take down the Cockatrice Wave and the Sword Wave really isn't going to end you. You're getting this far without... It, it'd be through, like, Revive Spam or something. Ah, oh, death. 95,000, not bad for Tiny Bridge. Echo Knight still did Echo Knight stuff. And multi-stage missile... Still putting out more than Thunderloop. That's pretty impressive. Alright, and for our final one for CO2 today, it's going to be heading over to Whiteout in the cold, cold home type. Yeah, that makes sense. Get some more beginning. Show off what uh, Summon Knight and Echo Knight can do. Those duplicator evos going. Lightning Ring, maybe getting it early will somehow make it better than homing miss and multi-stage missile. It seems increasingly unlikely. Oh man. Well, I have all three weapons, so these are all inevitable. And I prefer Empty Tome up first, because Empty Tome. And Duplicator. More projectile on everything. Now I can get a weapon power up. And it hits the one I didn't have as an option. <laughs> well, let's fill out the inventory. Oh, his music overrides the base. Huh. Empty tomb. Max out empty tomb. Max out your power. Oh, I want one more projectile. I want one more projectile very badly. I want one more projectile on everything very badly. Huh. Now getting Summon Knight on one of the monster characters would be a good idea. I mean, beginning only gives you plus three. They'll get you a plus... Three. And also plus four if you're Gavadoni, Force, or Simondo. Don't get both. Ooh, that was a good chunk of levels there. Hey, a Rosary, which I should have saved. Okay, yeah, passing through one more enemy is going to be a lot helpful. Oh, I guess they do count as enemies, won't they? Because 
Yeah, they're not going through them endlessly, so they're all we consider an enemy, not a light source. All right, science has proven once again something. Yeah, I have no idea where I was going with that. Some nights really good for cleaning them out, huh? Hey, some luck. This is what Siuto needs. Siuto. Nice damage up. That will not evolve. That will not evolve at all. Isn't it sad, Sechan? Isn't it sad? Well, I suppose it'll be less sad since you're apparently getting a root. Man, I haven't really kept up with that, or Grand Order for that matter. I just occasionally check the page to see what new servants have been released. Oh, summer event's probably coming up too, huh? So that'll be like, what, seven more? Oh, summer events. You are the most popular events of all, for very obvious reasons. I've never played a gotcha in my life and I don't intend to start now. Boy, would Vampire Survivors got to be awful. Uh, they're coming in really hard, huh? Increased level, giving them pre or then increased curse is really giving them presence. Man, not a lot of chicken drops, huh? Oh. That'd be a good way to get some damage done. Still no chickens, jeez. And we can spam the oral organs to just walk through them for a bit. Dang it. Well, focus on power first. On the other hand, it is this map. Wow, he do not want to hit anything near me, huh? Oh, there's a chicken finally. Try and avoid getting too many gems till I can get my evolution at 15 minutes in. This map is weirdly broken like that. Or hope this is a... Dang. Hoping it was a lucky... Jeez. I almost gave myself a heart attack thinking I didn't hit re-roll correctly. That was awkward. Car coming screaming down the alley when I'm out biking at 2 a.m. No problem. Wrong button press. Now that's scary. Huh. Did they dial up the damage on the missiles? Is that why they're actually decent now? That'd be a good reason. Yeah, heck, if even the robot wave is having trouble getting in, you know something's right. I should... Well, if I was a good person, I'd go check it with the Stanley videos. See how the damage compares. In the end, he'll have way more damage as well. Stanley. And that ever-increasing might, because that ever-increasing armor. Look at all them missiles go. Oh, hey, a chest. Right there it is. And it gives me nothing. One can't give me anything either. Man, I still can't kill them fast enough. Well, still had to make the attempt. Man, why are the dang 
chests on here are so dopey. Yeah, I don't think any other bonus stage. I don't think any other stage has the chest as messed up as here. Like you get the Arcana chest before the Evolution chest. I mean, what one is as bad? Maybe even it remotely as bad. Well, oh, rip fighting ring and thunder loop. I mean, back country I think is fine. Tactic Highway is evolutions from the start. Laboratory. I don't remember laboratory. I haven't played it that much. What's the other bonus stage? Moonglow? Well, Moonglow's chests are. Well, it's at 15 minutes. And it isn't timed correctly. But yeah, I guess Moonglow's is the only one that's broken. Well, maybe El Molise's, but who cares? You're not in any danger there unless you deliberately want to hurt yourself. What you do by playing El Molise? Ho ho ho! I don't even think there's an L in the Molise. I just keep calling it that way because it rolls off my tongue better. My poor, poor tongue. I'm gonna get awake just in case. I don't expect to die, but I still only have one evolution. 14 minutes in. These robots are getting pretty close. Well, the top is nice and clear, and I guess the multi-stage missiles can keep the bottom clear and Lightning ring is saying hello. Alright, Kitsun. If that is your real name, and I'm not confusing you with a pal from Pal World. Huh, nice. You went down really quickly. Yeah, I thought it was Amaretsu, but it wasn't. Amaretsu. I'm not even sure I'm pronouncing I mean, I should not be pronouncing that correctly, because... Bleh. Oh. Well, I mean, if you spawn in at 16, yeah. Huh. Killed both. Yeah, multi-stage missile DPS is actually very high. Oh. Echo Knight. I can find one of these dang vacuums. Actually level up. Yeah, turns out duplicator evos. Very good. Yeah, that was... Bye-bye, snowmans. You just drop XP? Nope, you drop power-ups too. Which means fun times for us all. I mean, fun times for me, and really, is not me having fun, fun for us all. No, you're here for my misery and suffering. Well, here you have it. Me having fun is miserable, because it means someone else has had the fun sucked out of them. You, the viewer, because you didn't come here for that kind of talk. Ain't come here for any kind of talk. Fork, fork. Wait, no, I can't do it on Monday. That would be a bad idea. Unless I wake up. Well, no. Every place is going to be closed at that hour. I don't have the time for that. Yay, random tangents, or yay, death. Well, yeah, turns out duplicator evil weapons, pretty dang good. Wow, Echo Knight, you are just incredible. And duplicator evos turned out to be pretty dang strong as...
Sioto Moonspell has taken us up to 404. Bridge. Probably Ona. 405. And 406 on the whiteout. Goody goody gumdrop, says they say. Not sure why I said it, but hey. Anyway, and it takes us down to 1,526 more to go. Yay. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Thank you to anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. And if you have, done, have not, please do so. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in Vampire Survivors.